dog, we have a lot of, you know, religions, yeah. cults. Yeah, that's what sex. we need to address, B. They put law on people. They're yep. telling people, yo, in order for you to have a relationship with God, you need to follow X, Y, Z. You need to follow these laws. If you don't do this, then you're not not saved. That is not the gospel of Jesus Christ. That is not mm. the gospel that Paul was preaching and sharing. And that's all over. Right? We got the cults. We always talk about the black Hebrew Israelites that are going back to wearing fringes <laughs> mm. and believing that they can achieve righteousness to be in the right standing of God based on that, based on keeping the Sabbath. Mm. Um, you have uh, Jehovah's Witness who, you know, in their belief, it's a works base. So mm. I got to put the hours in. I got to go out there and evangelize, evangelize, knock on doors, because <laughs> if you don't do these things, then you're not going to be in the right standing of God. What else? Seven Even day of Venice. Seven, seven day, day of Venice. Venice. If you don't keep, keep the Sabbath, which is on a Saturday. Dietary laws. Dietary, dietary laws. I didn't even know they had dietary yes, laws. They yep. had dietary laws. Then you're not in the right standing with God. Muslims. Yeah. So Muslims, which is a totally different God, totally mm -hmm. different religion. But the message is all the same, right? You, you have to achieve this um, holiness this justification, this righteousness through the works of your flesh based on these standards. Yes. Paul destroys that. Yeah. I'm, Clearly. I'm, yeah, and there's a lot of people, you know, that we, I know we all love that's in each and every one of those, you know, different religions and even different sects of Christianity, mm -hmm. you know, yeah, you, you, you might be saved, you know, you understand the gospel, you accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, but you still put yourself under certain laws, right? Mm -hmm. you know, and um, it's, it's just beautiful how Paul is like, you, that's not going to make you right with God, no matter how many of those commandments or laws you follow or you implement upon yourself, you implement upon your family, you implement on your church. Mm -hmm. You know, you even have leaders who implement this on their churches, just right. certain laws. Right. It's not going to. You can't wear skirts. Right. Yeah, like oneness Pentecostals. If you're not baptized and if you don't speak in tongues, you're not saved. That's another one, too. Yeah. Just implementing anything outside of um, just being in Christ. You know, understanding that Christ fulfilled the law and we are in Christ. Justified through yeah. faith. In and, Jesus Christ, yeah. Yep. And understanding that the only way, you know, even through just sanctification, the walk of having life and having peace with God is understanding that you are in Christ and that it was all done um, um, in Christ. Christ did it all. That's why we're going through this so that people can have that understanding because it's important because once you have that understanding, now you can set your mind on the things of the spirit and you know, really have the life, the peace, you know, the uh, the fruits of the spirit mm -hmm. and really, you know, live the abundant life. Understand that you are free. And you know yeah. what's crazy? If you understand this, you'll be able to spot the the fugazis. The counterfeits, yep. The legalism, you'll be able to yeah. spot the legalism, yeah. the counterfeits, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. the cults, because they're, they're going to go against. If they're going against the word of God, if they're going against the specifically the gospel of jesus christ mm -hmm. then dog don't run far <laughs> stay far away from that word